Dirty old town. Dirty old town. The idea here is that we do something with the community that engages the community and the community take hold of. The key things are memory, text and place. It's like almost like a recovered memory. I, uh, I was in the rowing club. Oh. It's often samplers, sampling some important periods and important factors in the history of public transport. For me, home is anywhere where you see the pink signs that say you are now in Salford. Right. <laughs> <laughs> The most important thing of all is to engage the community in the storytelling of Salford. Um, this workshop's not about me, it's, it's about you. Jot down a specific thing that happened to you. I was 17 and obviously you're still developing as a person, so they get you and they mould you to how they want you. And I find Salford very, very friendly. I'm a role model to my own community. It's, it's in my heart and my soul, it's, it's, it's part of me. I think people love to tell stories, and when they do tell their stories, whatever it's about, they're actually constructing their identity. Who streets? Our streets! One gentleman who had drilled holes in his bicycle frame so that he could top it up with his whiskey and brandy every time he walked in the office. Now, it was actually quite common for individuals to brew their own beer on their own premises. A pint of lager, please. A pint of lager, please. It will benefit them a lot because it will generate a lot of money and it will generate a lot of more people coming to Salford. A right old mix of characters. All with their own problems. Class is visible. It, it, it succeeded in getting people thinking, getting people remembering.